Hello, in this video we are going to look at this math book. It's called Unsolved Problems in Number Theory. It was written by Richard K. Guy. Problem Books in Mathematics, Unsolved Problems in Intuitive Mathematics. This is volume one. And yeah, let's see what this says here. Unsolved Problems in Number Theory contains discussions of hundreds of open questions organized into 178 different topics. They represent numerous aspects of number theory and are organized into six categories. Prime numbers, divisibility, additive number theory, diophantine equations, sequences of integers, and miscellaneous. To prevent repetition of earlier efforts or duplication of previously known results, an extensive and up-to-date collection of references follows each problem. Wow. So let's take a look. Problem Books and Mathematics, edited by P.R. Halmos. Paul Halmos. And here's the copyright. 1981, Springer Verlag, New York. For Erdos Paul. Among his several greatness are an ability to ask the right question and to ask it of the right person. Here is the preface. For many laymen, mathematicians appear to be problem solvers, people who do hard sums. Even inside the profession, we classify ourselves as either theorists or problem solvers. Mathematics is kept alive much more than by the activities of either class, by the appearance of a succession of unsolved problems, both from within mathematics itself and from the increasing number of disciplines where it is applied. Cool. So, pretty interesting stuff. So you've got all kinds of symbols here. Wow, I mean, there's just a lot of notation here. And I guess that goes to show, right? Like, I mean, th there's a lot of stuff here. So divisibility, just, just a lot of things. GCD, LCM, Mercene numbers. Yeah, just a lot of notation. And then here is the here are the contents of this book. Prime numbers, divisibility. That's cool. Lots of lots of topics here. Let me just let you look at these topics. Um, lots of things here. This is a pretty cool book. I'll, I'll try to remember to leave a link uh, in the description of this video um, to this book in case you want to check it out. Uh, I don't know if it's available or not or or anything. Wow, look at all of these topics. This is so hardcore. This is hard math. I mean, number theory has fascinated both the amateur and the professional for a longer time than any other branch of mathematics, so that much of it is now of considerable technical difficulty. Wow. However, there are more unsolved problems than ever before, and though many of these are unlikely to be solved in the next generation, wow, this probably won't deter people from trying. They are so numerous they have already filled more than one volume so that the present book is just a personal sample. Wow. Amazing. That's pretty cool. We can partition the positive integers into three classes. Cool. And then it goes on about primes, composite numbers. Here's some problems. Are there infinitely many primes of the form n factorial plus 1? The only values of n less than or equal to 230 which give primes are... It is not known if n factorial minus 1 or x equals 1 plus that product is prime infinitely often. Hmm. So these are unsolved problems. This is hard, hard mathematics. I just wanted to show you this book. Um, but yeah, uh, if you found any value in this content, feel free to hit subscribe. Also, check out my courses. Uh, they're on Udemy, but use my links, my website, mathsorcerer.com, or uh, from the description of my videos, I've got courses on a lot of stuff, not number theory, but calculus one, two, three, differential equations, algebra, all that stuff. Yeah, I hope it's been helpful. This is a cool book, right? Um, if you're into unsolved problems in number theory, just wanted to show it to you. It's pretty wicked. Take care.